Okay, it is week seven, day two, and wow. Uh, today was my worst run in a while. I was slow. Oh man. Ah, oh, you know I'm just. Ah, oh, I just covered it. Oh my, I stink. Sweat. Man, it's like I got up this morning. I felt great. Got plenty of sleep. All that good stuff. You. Huh. Plenty of sleep. All that good stuff. But. Oh, my legs felt like they're made of lead. I even like stretched out. I drank a little bit of water, and you know, not a ton because that's uncomfortable when you run. But yeah, I drink water before I went out. I mean, like I did. I didn't do anything different, but man, they felt like lead. I don't know what's up with that, but uh, oh, oh, excuse me, man. I did see lots of other people out this morning exercising, but man, it was, I, I, I gonna, I'm gonna blame humidity because it felt like, like swimming. It was bad. I like can't, you know, when you open the door and this wall of heat and humidity hits you like at one in the afternoon, it felt like that at five this morning, like 5.15, but yeah, open the door and it's phew, like, ugh. It's like, oh wow, it's cool. Literally about halfway through, I thought about coming, like running back to the house and running upstairs to the elliptical because, yeah, we have, we have an elliptical, which also like, yeah, I was seriously, it's like, it's like, you know what? That's still moving. That's still moving on the elliptical. But yeah, man, I was... I was slow and it, like I didn't get a stitch, but it felt hard to breathe. It felt that humid, just like, <sighs> every breath was hard. Like about, actually right before, it, you know, the, the halfway there voice came on, it was like getting rough to breathe for me. It's like, okay, it's just, it's just, it was so thick. The air is thick. Ugh. Seriously, it felt like swimming. It was just so humid and hot. It's warm. It's I don't know what temperature it is outside. But it's warm. Ugh. Yeah, I blame that. I, I ran less than a mile and a half. Like I ran the full I ran the full time, twenty five minutes, I think. Yeah, I, I ran the full time, but man, I just It was thick and my legs were like nope. No, not doing it. No. It's like, come on, legs. <laughs> I'm thinking, I'm like, come on, like, just keep going. So, yeah. I ran the whole time, but I was not fast. Not fast. Although, there was a difference. I ran, I didn't go uphill, but I ran downhill less this time. Which I know downhill helps me speed. <laughs> I ran downhill less. And I also like did a lot of turning. Like stopping and turning around. So I don't know if that hurt my pace either. But yeah. Whew. It was rough. <laughs> oh, but pretty uneventful. Ooh. Yeah. Rough but uneventful. I um. Uh, Let's listen to my, uh, my Drew Karin podcast, like I'd like to. Oh, what's it called? Case File. That's one. Australian guy narrates. At least he sounds Australian. Oh. Excuse me. Um. He sounds Australian. Um. And, yeah. Just run... Well, <laughs> try try to keep try to run mostly. It's a very slow jog, but you know I'm moving. That's the important part. I'm up. I'm moving. I I am breaking a sweat. Um, oh man, this eye is getting irritated. I have contacts. The salt. <laughs> there was like a film on this eye from the salt. 
which is lovely so yeah yeah rough this morning and, the, and it looks it looks like it wants to storm like super bad like it wants to pour like I remember when I let, walked out I'm like it is dark why is it so dark and it's lightened up a little bit I'm like oh it's because it's heavy cloud cover that would do it it's, it probably is going to storm later which I know Pittsburgh can mean it could storm for days Although, although, as I was running, I, I, the well thought was like, maybe I should just go inside and go on the elliptical, because it looks like it's just going to just open up any second. In which case, I'm going home. Um, yeah, if it opens up on me, like, if it, like, just starts a downpour, I'm running home. <laughs> Wherever I am, turn around and go back to the house as fast as I can. Um, but, admittedly, when I was thinking, maybe I should just go inside and get on the elliptical, because this is... I just do not want to be out here. It was so dull. It's humid. So humid. I couldn't imagine doing this in Florida. Oh. Oh, excuse me. Oh, man, that'd be awful. Anyway. Um, but yeah. But hey, if on Friday it is a horrible downpour, because, uh, yeah, I'm not going outside a nasty downpour. I at least figured out I can only just go on the elliptical. Because, I mean, granted, it's like no impact, but you're still, you know, you're still moving and getting the heart rate up. And it'll be interesting. I mean, it won't be able to affect my, my distance or my pace, but... Hey, ooh, Mara, what are you doing, silly? She just pounced up on the table. So, yeah. Well, I won't really be able to do my distance or pace, but at least, at least I'll do it. So... Yeah, at least I'll do it for the time. So there's a there's a backup plan. I was I was wondering. It's I think I was lucky that uh, knock on wood, I've only ever run in the rain once, and even then it wasn't a bad rain. It was quite a nice rain, pleasant. So yeah, it's good. Got a thing. Oh, excited though. I got on a I was interviewed for a podcast yesterday. Not about running, about uh about my, my coloring book, but that was cool. That was cool. <laughs> Not been interviewed, like, you know, for a podcast and like, well, that's cool. <laughs> it's cool. Um, yeah, I think, I think they said I'll put it on the website on Saturday and on Monday they'll be telling the internet about it. That's yeah, called the uh, High Regard Show. So I can't remember where they're based out of, but yeah. Called High Regard Show, and they have all sorts of stuff, including interviewing people about their coloring books. <laughs> Apparently, which is cool. Um, but yeah, that's it. Just I really hope the weather improves before Friday. <laughs> you know, ew, that was bad. That was this was bad. I was like, oh. Okay, but well, you oh, see, I need to get some food in me. Maybe, maybe I should eat a banana before Friday to help my legs or something. Cause yeah, they felt like lead too. Like on top of the nasty humidity and me like feeling like I was, yeah, you know, trying to breathe in a sauna. My legs felt like lead. So maybe I should stretch more. I don't know. Anyway. I'm gonna get some food. You guys have a good morning and uh, keep running. See ya.